Hello friends, welcome back to Do It New YouTube channel. Today our objective is how to create the Spectre library using NV applications. So uh, we are not spending more time for discussions. You can, uh, you need more information. Just comment on my comment box. So uh, we are do the practical here. Before I request you guys, do not forget to share and subscribe my YouTube channel. We call it Do It New, and also press the bell icon so I continuously provide you the update. So uh, this is a NV environment. You can see here this is a fresh environment. So uh, you can just look here the toolbox. This is a toolbox, and here you can search. Spectral Library Builder Just click on that and you can choose here the first input as spectral uh, spectrum You can see here. This is a combo box. You can select this one just select and uh, click on ok so this is a spectral library builder uh, environment uh, here having the lots of options you can see here the spectrum name color uh, source of the spectra band of this band of the spectrum wavelength and status so uh, just uh, we need to create the soil spectra the, how to create the soil spectra check my previous video how to create the spe spectral signature by using ASD field spec for device so I'm not spending much more time on that to uh, how to create the spectral uh, spectral signature just you follow my previous video and come to watch these tutorials so let's we just import uh, our spectral just click on here the import options and you can see here the spectral library builder having the menu that menu uh, just click on the import and uh, you can you can choose here the ESD binary file just click on that and this is a soil spectral signature i was already created a 1 1 to 30 soil spectral sample just select a 2 3 sample just open that you can see here very uh, uh, really interesting to how to this spectral library creation the spectral name of that is soil sample and uh, this is a color source of esd file uh, how many bands of that spectral signature 2151 bands uh, wavelength of that spectral signature 350 to 2500 nanometer and all are matches for the soil spectral signature just uh, we are selecting here the all options just select this all button just click on the plot this is a spectral signature uh, end member collection spectra last uh, who is creating the spectra that uh, signature are creating here you can see this uh, spectral signature uh, interesting point is here uh, suppose you want to uh, change uh, this data value change this unknown name and uh, you want to create the legend so suppose here so how we can do this very simple just uh, you can click here these options you can see here and uh, you editable uh, all value informations are displaying on the your window just we are change here the data value uh, you can see here this is a data value here and uh, we are give the y-axis title is a uh, reflectance you can see here change that and also we are uh, change here the unknown uh, this titles uh, unknown it is wavelength so we are adding here the wavelength and uh, 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 reflectance values are uh, variations so we are just change that value minus 0 0.1 and uh, y uh, axis max range is a 0 0.2 that's go to uh, moving on the top this is the reflectance of here as your requirement suppose you want to change this soil soil sample hour is red so oh, we want to change this soil spectral name guys you can see here this is a curve options this is general and uh, you can select here this particular individual soil sample so you can just uh, choose any one soil sample and add here the soil soil sample one just give the oh, this is a reference just one of the example we give that name you can see here this is a soil sample one and uh, this one is also give the name of change soil sample 
2 so I will sample 3 actually this one is a 2 this one is 3 this one is 4 so uh, like this we are changing all names suppose I want to change you want to change this color so you can also change that color we are adding here this some purple color and uh, green color we are giving here the dark brown color customize color you have possibility to change your as your requirement like this so uh, you can modify anything uh, uh, this is a spectral signature environment and you can modify this uh, spectral signature you can also change the line of dot dot also you can creating this spectral signature we are change the color so you can very easy to understand that like uh, we also increase the thickness of that particular soil sample like this and uh, uh, also the add here the symbols like a plus like uh, as star like a diamond uh, depend on uh, your requirement you can just uh, change uh, your uh, spectral signature library so indicating that spectra having the different uh, as compared to another spectra and uh, uh, almost our uh, this editing options is cover hope you understand this very well uh, you have any difficulties in this uh, editing options you can comment me on this uh, video so i will be reply to you and also create the you can also change the background color like this as your requirement you can add this uh, also uh, change the foreground color this is a entire uh, border options reflectance we will enter the end member collection spectra color is change as also change uh, the same member collection we are just uh, add here the soil soil spectral hyper lab department of computer science and IT so uh, you can see here the soil spectral library hyperspectral lab uh, dr baba sambadkar maratwara university this we are creating here the environment our spectral library like this uh, some changes i was do but it is high so um, just add here the wave length unknown wave length and uh, this is the reflectance uh, now our spectral library is created here uh, now uh, we we need to export that library before exp uh, export that library uh, i show you the options various options are uh, showing here you can see here this uh, spectral signature having the some uh, just not smoothing that spectral signature just click on the curve smoothing so uh, very easy. like this curve smoothing options also uh, scattering that you can see curve smoothing and uh, you can also add here the legends like this spectra is coming here so that's why we are just 0.2 So we are adding here the legends and uh, also cursor point uh, continuously visible to, uh, as your requirement you can visible that cursor you can also uh, new windows uh, with that uh, this is a plot new windows are creating here like this uh, now it is time to export this spectral signature for sp uh, soil sample spectral signature to exporting uh, one selected directory you can choose here and uh, uh, as your uh, requirement uh, ASCII as well as spectral library you can store so uh, just first we see here the ASCII spectral signature uh, enter the output file just click on here 
and uh, we are just creating the one uh, folder here you know, spectral c spectral library bamboo the library name just double click on that and give the name of the soil as spectral data just click on ok and uh, export uh, that to this is a spectral signature and also we are exporting the spectral library and same that file give the name of uh, spectral library and give same name spectral amp ok and export that both the spectral signature library we are creating here one library and export that spectral signature then uh, we are also export uh, that image but i will be showing the next uh, small tutorials and you can watch that just we are close this now our spectral libraries are created just we are uh, looking here uh, go to the desktop soils 100 soil sample and this is a spectral library directory and two uh, files are created here so we are just open that uh, file in this spectral library viewers just close this one and uh, you can search here spectral library uh, viewer viewer uh, just select the, here the spectral library viewer just click on that and uh, choose the uh, directory red soil sample in the spectral library and you can choose open uh, anyone anyone or all depend uh, require as a your requirement you can open this uh, spectral signature so guys our objective is uh, almost finished here mm, create the spectral library how to create the spectral library how to export that is spectral signature how to edit the uh, reflectance wavelength value all these details and you can see here the values are coming just click here and add here the uh, reflectance like this reflectance so guys uh, we are stop here before we uh, we are concluding this uh, spectral library first to guys do not forget to share and subscribe my youtube channel we call it do it noon also press the bell icon so i continuously give you the updation about this tutorial series thank you bye bye see you meet you on the next practical session